published 2220 Eastern Standard Time, the 15th of January 2018, updated 2220 Eastern Standard Time. The 15th of January 2018, January Jones is dating Nick Veal. The Mad Men actress is reportedly in a relationship with a Bachelor star after the pair hit it off after meeting on The Late Late Show with James Corden last year. A source told The New York Post's page 6 column, they've been dating for about two months. She went on The Late Show in mid-November and said Nick had reached out to her and tried to get her to lip-sync battle with him. She declined, but then he asked her out to a drink and she accepted. They've been seeing each other since, and his next rose goes to, January Jones is dating Nick Veal after meeting on chat show last year. According to a source, the supposed new romance comes five months after Nick's split with his The Bachelor fiancé Vanessa Grimaldi. The two were engaged on season 21 of the reality show, which aired in March. Meanwhile, January previously confessed she is on the lookout for dirty younger men. She said, the moment I see someone I think is cute, I Google him. And oh, he's 25, and I'm thinking, what's my problem, my sister too. She lives in Los Angeles and we both like tattoos, guitar, kinda dirty. The Mad Men actress is reportedly in a relationship with a Bachelor star after the pair hit it off after meeting on The Late Late Show with James Corden last year, seen here in November. Is the sex great though? Do they know what they're doing? I guess you can teach them. But I want a manly man in flannel with a beard and an axe. But there's always something wrong. Like, he's a Republican, January's friends have been keen to set her up on dates but she insists she isn't interested. The supposed new romance comes five months after Nick's split with his The Bachelor fiancé Vanessa Grimaldi. The two were engaged on season 21 of the reality show, which aired in March. Shea added, people want to set me up all the time and I'm like, no way, if I meet someone and we go out, fine, but I'm not going to look. I'm willing to make that sacrifice for the right relationship. I just don't feel I need a partner. Do I want one? Maybe. But I don't feel unhappy or lonely, it would have to be someone so amazing that I would want to make room. Someone who would contribute to my happiness and not take away from it. After I had Xander, I went on a couple of dates and I was like, I'd rather be at home sleeping, watching TV, or hanging out with my kids.